From FNNO.com, this is the Financial News Network. I'm Chuck Pierce, and here's a few things to watch for in the financial world today, January 15th. Dell stock popular on Wall Street this morning as the company's CEO is seriously considering going private. Bloomberg News reporting Monday the PC maker is talking to private equity firms about a possible deal. And with personal computer sales on the decline due to mobile devices like tablets and smartphones, a move to private could be what Dell needs to tackle other business segments such as storage and software and services. So far, the company has not made an official statement about the rumors, but some investors believe it to be true. Dell's stock is currently up over 4 percent on the news. ConocoPhillips dumping some of its assets to improve its balance sheet. The Houston-based company has agreed to sell its properties in the Cedar Creek Anticline to Denbury Resources for $1.05 billion. The Cedar Creek Anticline properties have yielded a net production of about 13,000 barrels of oil equivalent per day through November. The deal represents the company's refocus to its more profitable, less risky fields in North Dakota. Conoco says the deal should add $120 million to its fourth quarter earnings as it expected to close in the first quarter. Finally, British music retailer HMV going into administration to try and save some 4,000 jobs after failing to secure enough funding. The company, which owns 239 stores in the U.K. and Ireland, is looking to keep its doors open amid declining music, DVD and gaming sales. Deloitte has been appointed as administrator to the chain and will be helping the company find a buyer. Rumors have been swirling that Hilco might be interested in the retailer, but no official announcement has been made. HMV has been around since 1921 and is part of music history, having a role in the Beatles' first big break 40 years ago by recommending the group's demo to publishers. Those were a few things to watch out for here on the Financial News Network. For more coverage and analysis of the business world, follow us on Twitter at FNN Online or check out our website at FNNO.com.